started, we had a lot of renovations, and I just came across all these uh, that we had with the uh, 150th anniversary. Some of you may remember where we had poetry and archives, and we did um, poems, and I found a few of them. It was kind of neat. So I thought that we, we would bring it. Uh, and also I wanted to say to the Arts Council, thank you, too, because you showed our birthday, our peace wishes, for John Lennon, and we were able, we were able to have, Will Parker was able to have the first um, peace poems that went to John Lennon's Peace Tower. Thanks to Yoko Ono, who was very nice about that. She said they usually don't do poems, and I said, what about short ones? <laughs> but anyway, if you have time, you can take a look. These are just some of them from the project that we had. And um, it tells a bit about the history here, too, of the project. So our next honorary poet is Deborah Kelly. And she's another lady, it's a Renaissance lady. <laughs> and we're going right down the line here, so we might get through. Uh, did Shin Kun leave already here? She was just here a minute ago. Okay, maybe she'll be back. Thank you, Renaissance. We've lost Shin Kun, too. I'm going to start with that. Uh, I'm going to do a real spooky one. Seeing as uh, Halloween is uh, right around the corner here. I wrote this one this afternoon. It's called Back to Hell. <laughs> <laughs> Ghouls and goblins moving in. I cannot think in all this din. The air smells foul. It's hard to breathe. I feel creepy crawlies all over me. All of a sudden I start to itch. Panic has reached a fevered pitch. Oh my God, I'm lousy with fleas. Feeling faint, I drop to my knees. Where do they come from? Where do they go, these walking husks without a soul? How did they ever reach this state? Were they cursed as they neared hell's iron gates? How could they see through bleeding eyes? I pray they not notice I am disguised. For if I am dressed as grimy as they, I can scare them back to hell this way. <laughs> and I just want to, just real quick, Sunday at Heritage uh, Grill in New Westminster, back room, we're having our poet's Halloween party, dead or alive. Oh, wow. Costumes are optional, but if you wear one, we have lots more fun. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, it starts at uh, 2 o'clock. I'll have to so, sure. Definitely. <laughs> So uh, I'll be flying in on my broom. <laughs> okay. Thank you, and, and uh, to everyone here this evening, it's been a wonderful evening, and thank you for, for all your wonderful poetry. And Candace, Candace has uh, been my mentor now for five or six years, and I have learned so, so, so much. And congratulations, Ariadne, on the success of New Westminster Program.